What's going on, shady people? Shady Penguin here with you back to the next episode of our Pokemon Platinum Shady Lock Challenge. Today, we're picking up right where we left off in Mount Coronet, and this music is flames! This music is absolutely flames. Let's go ahead and continue on as we go through. Okay, we are at Spear Pillar. I don't think we can get an encounter here besides our static encounter. Oh gosh, I am so glad I checked our party. Holy Kris Kringle, we would have gotten rocked. And socked. Like rock'em sock'em boppers. Do you guys do you guys even know? I don't even know if you guys know what that is. Question of the day. What's your favorite or fondest? What is your fondest childhood toy? So what can you think of back in the day? I don't know for me that it's definitely sock and boppers, but they were pretty fire. Let me just do this real quick. Our boss is about to do something spectacular. Don't get in the way. Of course you will, won't you? That's why the two of us will team up to take you down in an epic duel. Is it 2v1? Is it really? Is it actually 2v1? It is? Oh my gosh! I mean, I've done 2v1s before. I don't know why I'm excited. I guess I'm thinking like 2v1. Like, I only get one Pokemon. I kind of wish that's what it was. Blaziken and Hypno. Oh my goodness. Okay, we have... Oh, we don't have good options. Okay. We will switch out into... I guess Dat Boy is the best switch in on that side because I resist both fighting and fire. And we're just going to have to go for confusion on the Blaziken. Um, Sock and Boppers, basically. You blew them up, you put them on your fist, and you punch your friends in the face. But the problem with Sock and Boppers is that afterwards, your hands always smelt like fish. At least mine always smelt like fish because you'd sweat so much. And the sweat with the plastic that it was, it was just not a good time. We see a Blaze Kick. I should resist that like four times because it's fi it's not firefighting, but it should be. Meditate. You're going to increase your what now? Your attack. Okay, that's fine. All right, so we can actually go ahead and we can flamethrower this Hypno and then we can confusion this Blaziken into Oblivion. Flamethrower probably won't one shot. I think Hypno has some decent special defense. So I don't think it'll one shot. Uh, no, it does over half though. That's great. And Blaziken's going to go down. It's really weird seeing. Look at Blaziken's eye. It's literally just pitch black. I really don't like it. It's so He's soulless. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I really do not. So of course, today is Sunday. And if you don't know, I am currently on a plane to Hawaii. I'm trying to remember what days these are getting uploaded because I think it's kind of fun to do that. Um, I'm currently on a plane to Hawaii. If you don't follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook, I advise you do all three. The three links are going to be in the description now. I'm trying to use Instagram a little bit more, especially because I know I'm going to be away in Hawaii. I'm going to be taking a lot of pictures, and instead of flooding Twitter with those, I think I'm actually going to use my, uh, I'm going to use my gosh diggity darn, uh, you know, let's just stay and let's go for it. Let's go for a giga drain. Um, I'm going to try to use my Instagram for what it's used for. So, at Shady Penguin, you can follow that if you want to, if you're an Instagram kind of person. I honestly, I haven't been, but I'm going to try to be. I'm going to try to be. Like, I, I started, and then I stopped, and then I started, and I stopped, and I started, and I stopped. But I should just, I should put, I just, I tend to put my pictures on Twitter. But realistically, I should just put them on Instagram. So, that's what I'm going to be doing from now on. Um, maybe there's some pictures that'll go to Twitter. You know what I'm saying? But, in the most part, mostly, mostly Instagram. Uh, Hypno uses Meditate again! It's, it's attack is getting pretty, pretty intimidating, but it's okay, because I believe an Ember, an Ember should take you out, and if not, the Giga Drain following suit will do the trick. Uh, Flamethrower did over half, so, okay, it's gonna leave you a little bit, Giga Drain! Let's go, let's go. So, I'm in, I'm in the sky right now, as this is uploaded. I'm not sure when you're watching this, but if it's past 9 p.m. Eastern, I have now landed in Hawaii, which is three... I was going to be at 3 p.m. their time, so it's going to be a crazy time difference. I'm not sure what I'm going to, how I'm going to handle that. Uh, we see Executor here. I'm actually just going to go for an Ember, and I think, you know, well, there's really no point in doing either of those. I'm just going to heal. I'm just going to use a Super Potion right now on Dap Boy, because there's kind of no reason not to. There's no reason to do anything else. Confusion is really going to do negligible amount. I guess maybe it could have picked up the Knockout, uh, but eh, eh, eh. I don't really think so. Uh, Ember is not gonna pick up the it's not gonna pick up the knockout that I kind of knew so I guess I could have done something We're gonna see an egg bomb on them on the squish, which is fine Uh, it doesn't do too much and we can just finish this thing off with an ember and at this point I'll just click rest because I know the ember is gonna one shot doesn't really matter Well, it's not a one shot. It's a two shot, but it'll take out it'll finish up the executor uh, It will finish up the executor boy since those last Sun and Moon news I'm not sure like obviously today's Sunday and I could have already missed some, some some more news or whatever But there have been so many fake leaks uh, scouring on the internet Please be sure before you like spread fault like don't retweet anything that's false information look into it a little bit first uh, Don't believe anything until you look into it yourself because man it is crazy It is crazy pulverized by our bosses Okay, so I think I think that we're supposed to have the big boy battle now So I'm gonna go ahead and heal up squish and we're gonna leave Luma out front. Luma, Luma's just been, Luma's been my guy, my gal. Oh my gosh, we've, oh, we have to do the trifecta. Okay. Where do you think you're going? I won't let you disturb our boss. If you're not gonna listen, you'll have to get through me first. After all, you've made me look bad more times than I care to remember. And I'll be next. You might be tough, 
But this time, the gloves are coming off. Oh, snap. Hold on a second. Did you start the party without me? Huh? Remember me? I'm here to get my revenge. Ha! If isn't that little boy, the little crybaby from Lake Acuity. Did you toughen up a bit? Sure, let's battle two on two. All right, so we're battling. Luckily, I'm glad we don't have to do, like, both those battles. We have Nips here. Poet Landon and Poet Rachel. Yo, I don't like Landon's outfit. Okay, so we have a Sharpedo and a Bellossom. Sharpedo and Bellossom. Nip sends out a Farfetch'd. Okay, this is not what you, this is not okay. Like, I want to discharge. I think I'm still gonna discharge. Does, does Nips have more than one Pokemon? All right, you know what, let's just, let's just spark the Sharpedo. We're gonna see an Aqua Jet connecting into Luma, which is fine, because we got Sky High defenses. A Spark should take you out. I think Sharpedo has base 45 defense. Uh, I know, I know that a discharge would do the trick, but, ooh, girl, we got it. I get hurt by the rough skin, that's fine, that's fine, it's not a big deal, it's not a big deal. Luma gains 1650, and Farfetch just sets up an agility. Well, I guess that's kind of good. Can you just please use, like, Leak Slap on Belossum and let it be flying type stun spore on my Luma? Of course, why would we just do that? I'm probably gonna have to switch out a new mix, I'm sure some sort, some sort of fighting or fire type's gonna come in. Oh, there's the, there. speak of the devil. Speak of the devil. Let's go into that boy. Because it's all we can do. We don't have an Emmet. We don't have an Emmet to go into. We just don't. Air Slash. There we go. There we go. Can that please? Is that actually going to do the trick? Uh, no, it's not. Oh my gosh. You're pathetic. Okay. So Fire Blast is going to come through and is going to connect on the Charizard. Luckily, we can eat that up like it's a bowl of hot tomato soup. I'm fine with that. Blossom flinches. Okay. That's kind of fire. Uh, I'm going to have to just go for a fly on the Rapidash. Night Slash. Okay. Come on. You could have. You could have. You could have just done your good deed. That did nothing. Farfetch'd gets, can we get an Alolan Farfetch'd? I want, I want Alolan Farfetch'd so bad. That's my new, that's my new desire. That's my new Sun and Moon like request. Oh my gosh, you need something Farfetch'd, you really do. Oh my gosh, Alolan Farfetch'd would be so cool. And a Volbeat, oh, oh boy, man. At least you can signal beam that Blossom. We're gonna see a helping hand. Yo, that's the strats! That's the strats! Nips has some strats! Oh my goodness. So that should pretty much one shot. What? Come on, man. That is ridiculous. That is insane. All right, there's a fire blast. Volby, you know, it was nice knowing you. You tried to help. You Honestly, Volby did what it had to do. It did the darn thing. It tried to help me take out the Rapidash. Unfortunately, that boy fell short. Do not stun support that boy. Please do not stun support that, that boy. Yes, the dodge, the dodge is real. Staraptor, yo, Nips likes them birds, birds. If you ever watch Pigeon Poker Party, you'd know that, that he likes those birds. Honestly, do yourself a favor. It's it's not it's not the most suitable thing for work, but you should look up Pigeon Poker Party H, uh, HD. That, that, that's a good video. It's a good video my friends and I made a while back. I think that it's pretty hilarious. Um, NSFW though, NSFW. Okay, Dat Boy, hit the skies. Hit those skies right now. Tell no lies and hit those skies. Stun Spore on the Staraptor. I hope you have guts, Staraptor. I really do. Hope you're not reckless. Mothman is going to come out. That's fine. It's a great fly target for me. I, I like getting rid of one side of the Pokemon. Because then it's 2v1. And we can handle it. So there we go. That should one-shot that Mothman easily. Little baby Brian. Brian's pet. Dat Boy gaining a bunch, and now Dat Boy getting paralyzed. Of course, of course, of course. Why would we not get paralyzed? Aerial Ace can, now that should one shot for Mr. Raptor. I mean, you only you only have 60% left, 65%. I don't get life anymore, man. I'm just gonna go for an Ember. I'm gonna go for the Ember. Sunny day setting up for the next Pokemon. My Ember is stronger now though, so joke's on you. I don't even get to Spitfire because Mr. Raptor outspeeds me. That makes me sad. That makes me sad. Luma gains 867. That boy uses Ember. There's no target. The sunlight is still strong. The sunlight is strong, my friends. Ooh, gong, 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 gong. Okay, so this is not that great. Uh, I'm actually going to switch out into Luma, I think. Luma is our best bet. We really only have four Pokemon in our party, which sucks. But there's nothing we can do about it. There is nothing we can do about it right now. Aqua Tail. The sun's up, though, so we should be able to eat that very well. We're going to see an agility. I think I'm, I think, listen, Staraptor, you need to go for a strong attack on Dugong, a strong attack on Dugong, I'm going to go for the Discharge, I just got pro played, I just got pro played, I think I just took Staraptor out, 
I can't believe I can't believe that just happened. This can't be happening. Live, 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 live. It's a crit! Oh, of course it's a crit. Why wouldn't it be a crit, ladies and gentlemen? Why wouldn't it be a freaking critical hit? Oh, you have six Pokemon to choose from? Oh my gosh. This is broken. They give us 12 Pokemon to beat six. How is that fair? All right, Sceptile's gonna eat that up. Luma goes for the discharge. Maybe we can crit the Dugong this time. Who knows? Knows, knows. It's not very effective on the Sceptile. Super effective on the Dugong, though. However, I'm three levels beneath yet, so that's not gonna one shot. Oh, we get the para. We got the para. What do you have? Don't, don't tell me. Don't tell me. What do you have? Okay, it's a citrus. That's right, Sceptile. Sceptile, go for. What did you even do? Go for a Leaf Blade. Go for a Leaf Blade, please. There we go. That's Swords. That's Mega Man Battle Network 3. Let's get it. Let's get it. Okay. I would have foamed so hard. You would have been calling me Mr. Foam Central. That would have been absolutely terrible. That would have been absolutely terrible had that sheer cold hit. Oh my Lanta. I would have been mad. I would have been super duper mad. Okay, Luma grows to level 40. That boy grows to level 46. The sunlight fades and there is a mill tank left. Well, I'm pretty sure I can still stay in with who I have. Uh, I can go for a discharge here. Body slam on Luma won't matter too much. It will do a decent amount of Sceptile, though. Oh my gosh, you took out Sceptile that easily. Discharge should be a little bit stronger now that it's not... Well, I don't think it counts as spread if it hits 20. I'm not sure. I really don't know. We'll probably get the power because we're lucky. No, no, we will not. Another Tropius. I mean, another flying type. So you've had like you've had like three or four flying types now, Nips. What is going on? Body slam on the Tropius because you're not going to do it on Luma. That's fine by me. Uh, Magical Leaf. You're lucky that's not Sap Sipper, man. You could have screwed us big time if that was Sap Sipper. That would have been the worst. That would have been the app. And Luma's fully power. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, Luma. Body slam again on the Tropius. Just don't crit. Don't crit. Get another Magical Leaf off. And Luma, don't get fully paralyzed this time around. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. I truly appreciate you. Luma is paralyzed and cannot move again. And Tropius will go down this time. Which means Luma, if you can break through, you'll be golden. Oh my gosh, triple para. Can we stop this nonsense? I like triple jiggles. Okay, Raichu, end this. Raichu, yo, now we have the strats. Goes for the quick attack. We didn't even get to see the strats. Shoot. I was going to say, you could have the um, lightning. Is it lightning rod that you have? I think you have lightning rod. I'm not sure which one it is. Maybe it's not Lightning Rod. It's not Motor Drive. I'm not sure which one it is. I've done it before on NVGC though, so I'm, I'm, I'm hay as well. <laughs> My Pokemon are tough, right? I can get even tougher. But you know, that's it for us. We've hit the wall. Shady, I'll help you with this. Okay, there's our free heal that we could not control. Um, and you know what? I'm gonna count that as that heal that we found in the in Team Galactic, so I'm glad I didn't use it. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> uh. Everything is ready for the creation of a new world. Now all will end and everything will begin with this, the red chain made from the crystals of the three lake Pokemon. And this, the red chain I replicated with technological means. With these red chains, I will pry open the portal to another dimension. I command that you unleash your power for me. Oh snap. This is a big deal. Dialga, the mythical Pokemon and the master of time, and the other. Palkia, the mythical Pokemon and the master of space and dimensions. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Yo, we're about to, we're about to do something that I haven't done in years of playing Pokemon. I have not been to the Distortion World in years. I don't even remember it at all. I really don't. If that's even where we go right now. I've waited so long for this moment. Dialga and Palkia, shaping this world as a double spiral of time and space. Yes, the very things that you have the ability to control. You will do my bidding. I will have your abilities as mine. With the power I wield, I will create an entirely new world. The incomplete and ugly world we have can now disappear. I am resetting everything to zero. Nothing can remain. It is all for making the ultimate world, a world of complete perfection. Nothing so vague and incomplete as spirit can remain. Oh, snap. And this is where it all comes together. This is where, it, oh, snap. Look at the bottom screen. It's Vision. It's Mesprit. 
It's Squish! And then we have his elf, Clouded. Coming to, coming to keep things in order. They're spinning. I should have expected as much. The being of knowledge. Azelf, the being of willpower, and Mesprit, the being of emotion. The Pokemon have come to protect Sinnoh? <sighs> Pathetic and worthless. It takes the three of them, the three lake Pokemon that symbolize spirit, to balance either the Pokemon of time or space. But they can't maintain balance against the two, not when both Dialga and Palkia, Palkia are here. They're coming here is in vain. So much meaningless drama. Now, sounds like YouTube, shady. You've constantly interfered with my plans, but you will be forgiven. After all, there will remain no spirit for all, for all time when I am done. All spirit will disappear. It will be ripped away from you, from your Pokemon, from those precious to you. It is time. My dream will be my reality. What is this pressure I feel? Something is enraged. Oh, snap, it's Satan himself. Yo, this is kind of lit. Interesting. So, there is a Pokemon that can only appear as a shadow. Regardless, the effort is rash and foolish. I have harnessed the powers of Dialga and Palkia. This should be on the top screen, man. What are they doing? What are they doing? Why would they why would they put this on the bottom screen? Oh gosh, I didn't even get to read that. There we go. No! Uh-oh, uh they're going in deep. They're going in deep. They're 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 just diving head first. They know what they gotta do. It's their job. It's intrinsic to their being to jump in. Oh no, wait. Oh, Squish, of course Squish doesn't go in. Squish is in her party, that's why. Oh no, Squish is going in, Never mind. Squish just had to say goodbye first, that's all. I'm sorry I took so long. I think I finally found the answer from studying the myths. When the world was made, Dialga and Palkia appeared. Apparently there was one more Pokemon that appeared at the same time. A Pokemon with as much power as Dialga and Palkia, but also one whose name was never to be spoken. Giratina! It's said to lurk in another world, a world on the opposite side of ours. That's what the shadow was. It must have been Giratina. The pillars are distorting. It's because of that portal. It's joined us to the other world. If it's not closed, the distortion will spread to Sinnoh and beyond. Our world will be destroyed. Are you ready? We have to chase Cyrus. We have to hurry. Or right, we're jumping in. Do -do 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 -do. It's Twilight Zone right here. That's pretty crazy. That whole scene was pretty awesome. All right, here we go. I don't know if I've ever done this. This place, can you feel it? There are no Pokemon here at all. Time isn't flowing and space isn't stable. A world where the rules are broken. A space one might call the distortion world. Let's find Giratina. We needed it to stop the spreading distortion at the Spear Pillar. Well, that was Giratina. That was Giratina. We have to hurry. If something's not done, the distortion world will swallow not only our world, it will overwhelm the distortion world. What? Oh, the distortion will overwhelm the distortion world. I got you, I got you, I got you. Can we hop on, can we hop on these? We can, ooh. I guess that's over here just to show you like, hey, you can hop. That's about it. It's just to let you know that hippity hopping is the way, all right, let's go talk to Cynthia first. This rock slab, it appears to move if you step on a certain spot. Okay. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's go back up. Let's go back up. Cynthia, don't say anything. Okay. Will we get to see Giratina if we keep going down in this distortion world? Are we really traveling downward? I don't know. Hop those stones, Cynthia. Hop those stones. I'm going back up. I'm going back up. I'm not trying to miss anything. So we have to head all the way to the depths of the distortion world. This is pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. This is pretty darn cool. I've never, I, I, I can't remember when I did this last. Okay, there's nothing over here. Awesome. Sweet. Literally just distractions. I love some distractions. That's it, we're not adventuring anymore in here. There's no Pokemon, which means there's probably no items. So I don't know why I'm trying to explore. We just gotta head south. Is it really south when you're heading down? I don't think so. Down is not south. South is a, uh, pee. or pee, or pie. Woo, we are, 
We are feeling like we are something special right now, I'll tell you that much. All right, so Cynthia apparently already headed down and the slab came back up for no good reason. Uh, I love continuity. Okay, now we have decisions to make. Um, let's go left first. Ooh, I think that was the right decision. <laughs> now let's try going up. Repel wore off. Oh, so only one, oh, only one will work anyway. Oh, never mind. this is the wrong way. This is the wrong way. <laughs> well, it's definitely not gonna be straightforward. It's gotta be, it's gotta be to the right. It's gotta be to the right. Okay, I guess it's straightforward. Never mind. it's exactly straightforward. That's, that's what it is. So now this should be to the left. Okay, this, this, these controls are really awkward. These controls are really, really awkward. Um, there we go, okay. The legend of Giratina has been all but forgotten, but to few. The legend told of a world on the other side of ours. This world. Why does this world exist? Why is Giratina here all alone? There's so much that can't be explained, but we have things to do. Let's split up. We have to find the right way. Okay, we're splitting up now. We are going to split up because that's what Cynthia wants, and Cynthia is the boss of me. She is the champion after all. I mean, we don't know this yet, but, but I know this. Like, the player doesn't know it, but the player knows it. Let me guess, nothing over here? Oh, there is something, there is something indeed. Indubitably, indubitably so. Okay, let's try heading to the left. Actually, the right looks interesting. So it's not right, it is left! Was that just one giant circle? I really hope not. I really hope not. No, it's not a giant circle. Is it a giant circle? Okay, the stones go back up anyway, so my previous statement was null and void. Ha! Now saying null and void is a Pokemon joke. You get it? Comedy. Comedy, 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 comedy. Let's step on the center. Where does that bring us? Down deeper. That's where we want to go. I hope we get to catch uh, Giratina. Ooh. I hope we get to catch Giratina. Oh, no. The shadowy Pokemon isn't here. It abandoned me here, then disappeared somewhere farther down. Was it content merely to interfere with my plan? Incidentally, do you understand the concept of genes? No. No, of course you wouldn't. Genes can be considered the blueprints of all life forms. That includes humans and Pokemon alike. Genes are contained in a DNA strand. A DNA strand consists of two chains of opposing characteristics in a spiral. If one of the chains were to be broken, the other could replicate it. One or the other cannot exist without its opposite. Do you understand where I'm going with this? This is a bizarre world. Time does not flow. Space isn't stable. Only the shadowy Pokemon lives here. This world is the opposite of our world. Our world I wish to change. It is like the two chains composing a strand of DNA. The two worlds must be balancing each other to remain in existence. Without the one, the other cannot exist. The shadowy Pokemon must play a role in keeping the worlds in balance. That is why it must have interfered and brought me here. The shadowy Pokemon must have made this bizarre world. That's why trying to change our world disturbed it and made it reveal itself. But that is all irrelevant. What matters is defeating that Pokemon and making this world disappear. I won't allow it to interfere with me again. With it gone, neither world will be able to revert to its original states. Interestingly enough, despite Arceus being, being like the creation Pokemon and creating just about everything, um, Giratina actually created the distortion world according to that, which means that it has some ability to create, which I think is interesting, that there is technically more than one creation Pokemon in this game. Interesting, or did I just waste all your time and, okay. All right, where, how am I, how am I supposed to be doing this? This way? Aha! So if you see nothing, you actually see something. No, I wanna go down, Dad! Wait, is this where I came from? I actually think this is where I came from. Let's not, let's not ruin everything. Let's not ruin the good times. Yeah, I think this is where I came from. Then we saw Cyrus right here. So we should be able to go over here and bam! Yes. So I'm only gonna go where there's no platforms, like that. Because that seems to be the trick to doing things successfully. It seems to be the trick to doing things successfully. If you see a platform, it's not actually there. See, like right here. We don't see, oh gosh, we're going deep. We do see things, okay. But those aren't platforms. Those are, well, those are, but they're single platforms. So they're they're actually there. They are actually there. Look at this. This reminds me of, um, what was that game I played? Soma? This reminds me of a little bit of Soma. Okay. Um, I'm afraid to hop this, but I'm going to. Oh, Ooksie. Come on, Vision. What are you doing for me, Vision? What are you doing for me? Do you want me to push that rock down there? What if I didn't have strength? Well, I guess I have to have strength because I had to I had to use it to get to this point. There was no way to deposit Pokemon. I think I'm just supposed to push it down. Can I chase down after it? I can't. Okay. So we gotta keep pushing it down. Huh. Interesting. 
Interessante. For sure. Now, where are we? Wh where's the goal of pushing this stone? Oh, I have to push down one of these three. Well, Uxie's telling me to push down the bottom. So I'm gonna I'm gonna push it down here. I'm basically gonna gonna follow Uxie's lead. Vision has the vision. So I'm going to move this here and then drop it down. Is that correct? Ah, that was correct. Okay, awesome. So that means that I'm sure there are more stones for us to push. Uh, let's 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 not let's not do anything too hasty just yet. Let's look, let's explore down here because I'm I'm thinking that maybe there's a way to get back up over here. Maybe there's not. Okay, maybe there is not. Shoot. Maybe there is not, but maybe there is. We want to explore completely. I mean, oh, Cynthia. This place, it seems to be a giant puzzle. Maybe Giratina wants to test those that visit here. It appears as if we can't go unless we solve the puzzle. There were some boulders that could be moved. All right, wait, I got it. I got it. I understand. The Pokemon of the lake seem eager to show us something. Yada, yada, yada. Yada, yada, yada. Let's proceed then. Uh, with this puzzle. Okay, here we go. Ah, my good friend Squish. My good friend Squish. Yes, see, Squish loves me. Hovering around the stone. Okay. And you're going right down that hole. Okay, we're going down that hole too then. We're going to go down that hole just as well. Oh, I have to sneeze. Oh, gosh. <coughs> oh, man. Sorry I couldn't mute. I knew I didn't have time. I knew I did not have the time to mute. And there should be a way to go down over here, which there is. Aha! Oh, we're going up, actually. What the heck? It's almost like going down, but it's the opposite! <laughs> okay. Oh, wow. What? This is madness. Woo! Whenever that happens, I get a little scared. I get a little scaredy-poo. Oh, no, they're actually there. You're not, though. Ho oh, ho! Wow, we solved that rather easy! All right, well, we're going up, though. I want to go down. This has to be the right way, though. Oh, no. Hopefully, like, me doing what I'm doing right now and going backwards isn't, like, resetting the fact that I pushed that stone because that would be a drag if I have to go directly down first. I don't think it would be the case. That would be kind of lame. And by kind of, I mean, like, extremely lame. So I don't think that's the case. Of course, that's not actually there. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? So this seems to be the only thing that's there. Okay. Uh, there's something here. Wow. I thought, I knew that that would disappear, but I thought maybe something would appear in the other spot. Okay, that's nothing as well. Jeez. Talk about your dead ends. This this thing, this place should go to get a haircut because it has so many dead ends. Those are called split ends, Shady. Mm, they're also called dead ends. I don't think I'm, I don't think I'm completely wrong in saying that. Maybe I am, who knows? Okay. Cyrus is here again. What does he have to say for himself? Where'd he go? What the heck? He was definitely just here, right guys? Cyrus was definitely just right there. That was really strange. That was super strange. What is, woo, Giratina. Okay, let's hop on this wall. Oh my gosh, I don't like this. I don't have waterfall yet, so I can't, I can't do it. Unless this is actually me riding down a waterfall. It is. Jeez, this is an extensive puzzle for Pokemon, I feel like. This is an extensive, extensive puzzle. But we did manage to find this rock, which I don't know if this is the one we pushed or if this was just the next one and I gargled completely by doing what I did. It's a possibility that I was just supposed to simply jump back on there and, and, and go backwards, but it's okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Let's go ahead and, ah, we have clouded. Cody is here hovering over the rock and says, hey, push that, in the, push that in the hole, please. In case you haven't figured it out by now, push this in the hole. Uh, hopefully that other rock is still down there. That would be super convenient. If not, we'll, uh, we'll figure it out. We'll go back and have to do it again. But I'd like to at least solve the puzzle and push the three stones in place before we, um, before we end this episode. So we got that one stone. Let's go down here. Let's see if both stones are down here. We'll find out. Uh, let's see. He wants it in this one right here, which is perfect, because it is the closest one. Just gotta follow where Cody wants the rock. Put the rock where Cody needs it. Hello! Okay, I wonder what the what the significance is. Ah, and the rock is down here. Awesome. 
I wonder if there's a significance in the specific pits that we're putting them in. I'm not sure. If you know, let me know in the comment section below and leave that vote, a, leave that comment a thumbs up. Okay, so we did, we did all of that. I understand the keep bounds. Does it mean they can't do that with Giratina? Oops, this is no time for idle chit chat. There we go. So we had to talk to her again. Awesome. Ah, platform appeared. Let's go. All right, so we solved that puzzle. Let's go down. Let's go down. Let's do it. Uh, I think we might have to battle Cyrus here because our Pokemon got fully healed for some reason. I know it's some reason. I don't know exactly what the reason is. This is it. Kiritina's up ahead. So we're going to go ahead and wrap this one up and we're going to save uh, the last part of this for the next episode, which of course is going to be uploaded on, uh, I think possibly Wednesday or Thursday. I might be switching uh, the Shady Lock to just three times a week while I'm away, especially because we have the, the Soul Link going up. Putting the Soul Link and the Shady Lock up on Tuesday would be kind of crazy because realistically, I know a lot of you guys are just gonna skip the Shady Lock for Soul Link and I don't blame you, not to mention it's just, uh, I was doing one, I wanted to do one video a day. So either we'll keep Wednesdays no uploads or we'll have the Shady Lock back to back with Wednesday and Thursday. I'm not sure which one I prefer. I probably prefer just three times a week. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed yourselves here and your time. And if you did, don't forget to subscribe down below so you don't miss any of our content. I love you so much but i'm gonna get the hashtag out of here have yourselves a good day but above all else keep it shady